So I'm totally aware that I'm uploading a cursed Minecraft image video on Minecraft's birthday, but hey, I already uploaded my video yesterday, so you can't blame me for this. But it is Friday night, so it is another episode of Cursed Minecraft Images, a long-running series on the channel on episode 11. And this is one of my favorites now because it's so clean and so obvious what I'm doing. But as usual, if you guys have any Cursed Minecraft images you'd like to send me, you can post them on my Twitter page, you can go to my subreddit, r slash phoenixsc, and fire away. But if you haven't figured it out yet, this minecart track is wrong. You can't go that way, you can't go up, uh, but it's going up, it's gonna go up here, it's gonna swing along upside down, swing back down here, and then turn around and end up uh, back where it started. So, let's give it a shot. And let's fire it. So it goes up, turns around, goes upside down, goes down here, lands back on this slope, and finishes on the other side. Let's run this one again. This time we'll just stand back and stare at it. So this part is a little bit jittery, but you can't blame me. This is so wrong, but it works. And you can sit in this thing, uh, and it doesn't actually work the other way. This is highly specific. It's going to kick you back and say, no, the player camera can't do that. There was in fact a glitch a long time ago, it must have been two or three years ago, where you could force the player camera to turn 360 degrees if you open up your chat dialog while you have a command block teleporting the player in that fashion. That has been removed, but it would have been so useful for this design. So while I did try and I don't want to disappoint you guys, it doesn't actually work here. So the minecart will kick you out while it's trying to force the player camera to turn around. But it knows that you can't do that, so I'm very sorry. So here's one last look at it, very close up this time. It does do a little kick here. Uh, there is the platform, uh, just to show you guys how this is actually working. Um, it doesn't fly, so <laughs> minecarts cannot fly, they're not anti-gravity. Doesn't matter what you try to do, you can't levitate a minecart. So I actually had to put a barrier platform with fake detector rails that are flipped like this. And uh, this is actually a ladder, as you guys can see. The minecart is climbing a ladder. The minecart is also climbing a vine. And the minecart is also riding a fake powered rail, because you can't do that with powered rails if they don't have anything connected. But it's connected to a ladder. So rails are connected to ladders, which are connected to vines, which are connected to upside down detector rails, which are on invisible barriers. So the only two fake blocks that you have to recognize here is this one, which is the upside down rail, and the vine. And of course, the ladder. There we go. So anyway, hopefully this explains everything that you guys need to know. If you're interested, this is what my inventory looks like right now. It's a complete mess, but you know, I have so many different slots that are available. This is going to take a very long time for me to complete. And if anything, I'll just wipe everything, send it to you guys when I'm ready, and you can mess around with it as much as you want. Anyway, thank you all for watching. Leave a like, subscribe for more creative content. And as usual, if you have any cursed images or stuff that you want to show me, you can tweet me, you can also leave a comment, and you can go on my subreddit, r slash phoenixsc, for all the fun that is happening there, because there's so much stuff happening there that I really want to share with you at some point. Take care.